Okay, in this video we're going to factor the rather messy looking trinomial 6x squared plus 23x minus 18. Okay, well let's just dive right into it. Write our parentheses there. And uh, uh, I know that I'm going to have a positive and a negative, a plus and a minus here, because I can look over here and see that I have a... Uh, a negative product, and the only way you get a negative product is by multiplying a positive number times a negative number. So, uh, well, I know that. Um, I'm not sure I know too much more than that. I know that the way we can get 6x squared is by doing 6x times x, or 3x times 2x. And that's, uh, that's all I have there. Uh, and then to get 18, I have uh, I can do 18 times 1, or 6 times 3, or 2 times 9. And like I said, I know that, and then I'm going to multiply this term times this term, the outside terms together, and I'm going to multiply the inside terms together. Like I said before, one product will be positive, one product will be negative, and so when I combine those two, I'll get... 23x, positive 23x. And since one product is positive and one product is negative, that means I'm going to be subtracting. Okay, so um, well, let's just start looking at some possible combinations. Uh, if I take uh, 6x times 18 minus 1 times x, I get I'm not sure what that is, but it's way too big to be 23, so that's not going to work. If I take 6x times 6 minus 3 times x, I'm going to get 36 minus 3, which is 33x. That's also wrong. If I take 6x times 2 minus 9 times x, I'm going to get 12 minus 9 is 3x. That's actually too small. So the 6x and x... I tried that combination here, and that looks like it's not going to work. Now, here's why I'm not going to try x on this side and 6x on this side. If I try x on this side and 6x on this side, I'm always going to get an even number times x minus an even number over here, because it's going to be times 6x. Even minus even does not equal 23. Okay? Even minus even equals even. I need even minus odd. So I'm going to have to always have an even number times an even number minus an odd number times an odd number. Okay, so let's try, uh, let's try 18, 1, 6, 3, 2, 9. Let's try them with 3x and 2x now. And like I said, I'm going to do 2x times 18, 2x times 6, 2x times 2, and this is going to be uh, 1 times 3x, 3 times 3x, 9 times 3x. Okay, 2x times 18 gets me 36x uh, minus 3x is uh, 33x again. That's not going to work. 2x times 6 is 12x minus 9x equals 3x again. That's not going to work. 2x times 2 is 4x minus 27x equals negative 23x. And although that's not... What I was looking for, it's really close. Instead of getting a positive uh, uh, 23x, I got a negative 23x. So what that means is, instead of doing 2 times 2, 2x times 2 minus 9 times 3x, I just need to go the other way and do 9 times 3x minus 2 times 2x. So let's put that in there. We're going to do 3x times 9, and, oh, and we said that's going to be the positive one. And we're going to subtract uh, 2x times 2 from that. So let's see if this works. 3x times 9 is 27x, and negative 2 times 2x is minus 4x. 27x minus 4x is 23x. Yes, it works. That was really messy, but as you see, we got it done, and uh, didn't take too long.